Gillette Cavalcade of Sports. <laughs> Would you like to wait inside? No, uh, my uncle owns the building. I'm, uh, I'm Tom. Tom. You were a pin setter with my grandson a long, a long time ago. I'm Walter. I'm supposed to be meeting my grandson here. Do you want to play a game, Walter, while you wait? Are you any good? Get a drink, do you want? Coffee would be good, thanks. Sure. I'm his son. Oh, you know, your father's a brilliant man and a wonderful English teacher. You know, my grandson. Just a minute. This is a picture of him just before the war. He loved poetry because of your old man. He introduced them to Alfred Lord Tennyson. A charge of the Light Brigade. That's right, exactly. Boldly they rode and well to the jaws of death and to the mouth of hell. 
rode the 600 forward. The Light Brigade. And that was the poem that inspired my grandson to enlist. What about you, Tom? I was classified as 4F. They dismiss you for the smallest things, but I have this problem with my arm. Even though it's on and off, I, they labeled me as 4F. Well, most days it's fine, but uh, there are, there are days when I'm walking past the shops on Bridge Street and I, I catch my reflection in the windows and I'm reminded of how everyone in this town sees me as a, a man who stayed behind. Even though I, I didn't have a choice in it. My friends went to war. I wanted to go and I, I got left behind, so four I fear number and a number and a letter that just defined me wherever I go. Only if you allow it. Come on. I want a rematch. Nothing really wrong. It's just I wish you were here. I don't know if I should finish this last frame. I'm um, at 113, four more pins, and I'll beat him, and he's not here to see. Walter, I guess now is as good a time as any to tell you this. Well, tell me what? Uh, Walter, I, I'm moving. I got a job in the city, so this is going to be our uh, last game together. Tommy! <laughs> you were a pin setter with my grandson. Yeah, yeah, we, we were pin setters together on the weekend. <laughs> here in this lane every Saturday and he was so good. I could never beat him. Oh, those are great memories, Tommy. You know, if it wasn't for my grandson, I don't think I'd ever step into a bowling alley, but this game brought us closer. Hmm. Walter, I, I really want to see you hit this. Me too, Walter. Me too. You know, there's a not much I'm gonna miss about this town, but I will. I will miss this place. You know, I want you to have this. A memory to take with you. Uh, my memory's not so good these days. Well, I guess my grandson isn't going to make it. See you next week, Gerard. Oh, 
propicie em Iwan.